We're walking through this beautiful environment here. It's hard to believe that underneath our feet, we're walking on top of a whole nother world altogether. This area is a Wombian area and these hills here are literally covered with hundreds of caves and cave systems among some of the best limestone cave examples in the country. So we're here and we're about to go down below and check out what lies beneath. <laughs> Often when you think of caves, you think of really small places that are hard to get into, but this is far from that, a wide open cavern, ready for anyone to explore. Well, as you leave terra firma somewhere up there and walk down this windy little staircase, you come to this big, beautiful cavern here and you can't help but be struck by a sense of awe. Not just that nature's amazing ability to decorate with these beautiful flow stones here, the amazing stalactites and stalagmites, but just the sheer amount of time it took for all of this to be created. It's a rough estimate that each stalagmite takes about a thousand years to grow a single inch. So you could only imagine how old that must be. Growth rates of these formations is highly variable, but you're still looking at probably tens of thousands of years of development just here. Everything that you see before you here now has been dripping and splashing and flowing for hundreds of thousands of years. Each drop of water is leaving behind a small amount of calcium carbonate, which is dissolved out of this bedrock by slightly acid water. So depending on how the, the drip water behaves when it enters a cave determines the sort of decoration you'll end up with. So cool. Stalic might might touch the ceiling. Stalic tight has to hold on tight. Otherwise it'll fall. 